Hey guys, welcome back to your channel. Um, in today's video, I have for you what's in my dog's diaper bag. Um, I've showed what's in my dog bag and then um, my walking bag, but I updated it and turned it into a doggy diaper bag for my one-year-old Shorty. Um, if you do not know what a Shorty is, it is a Shizu and Yorkshire Terrier mix. It's a 50% mix between the two breeds. So, this is her bag. This is actually one of my bags that I wanted to be used for hers. It's got two side pockets. I have one right here. And one right here. Oh, you can see that. And then it's got a zipper pouch on the back of it. Right there. So, let's go ahead and get into what's in her diaper bag. So, like y'all saw in the two side pockets on the outside, I have two water bottles. Um, I might put both in one side pocket just to um, use the other side pocket for me, a water bottle or something. And the smaller zipper pouch on the outside, I have some Culminade. I have her collar with her dog tag and her rabies tag. I have her bows. Her children's Benadryl, the syringe and the measuring cup. Her brush. Her face combs. And then I have her, her toothpaste and two toothbrushes. And her detangler, which I've bragged about before. That came from PetSmart. I have the leash with the dog waste bag dispenser. That matches her collar. And these you can find at Petco, I believe. And the collar is adjustable. The leash has metal hardware. That's what the part you clip on their harness or collar is. And then it has a D-ring up here by the handle. That allows you to clip a hand sanitizer, a doggy waste bag, you name it. And then I have one other thing in that pocket, which is her doggy cologne. Which I get from Walmart. And it's Oster Fresh Knuckles in the Raspberry Scent. So that is what's in there. And I am looking into getting her a better face comb or maybe a metal one. Um, so I'm going to have to keep buying Dollar Tree men's, comb, men's hair combs. Um, so yeah. So let me put everything back in that pouch and then I'll show you what's in the main compartment. Okay. I'll just have to stick her combinate in the main compartment. But anyway, um, in the main compartment I have two Ziploc bags of pee pads. There's, I believe, three in each pack. Yep, there's three in each sandwich bag. In another sandwich bag, I have her small pair of nail clippers and doggy waste bags and a Germex hand sanitizer in the back there. I have a backup leash and a backup harness. Next thing I have are some treats. This is also continued her overnight bag and will last her maybe two to three days. So, the treats will last her a whole lot more than that, but just saying. Um, 
And then I have a few toys for her. This one, Kinko's in the tail, squeaks in the head. This one, same, Kinko's in the tail, squeaks in the head. This one just squeaks in the tail, and it does not squeak in the head, so it just squeaks in the tail. And then this one also just squeaks in the tail. Um, next I have in here are dog wipes. Gotta have these on hand in case you were to get muddy or her paws dirty and I can't bathe her right away. Um, these come in great handy and these I get from Walmart. These are the Vibrant Life Vanilla Coconut Deodorizing Wipes for dogs and puppies. Do not get continued with the pink packaging. The pink packaging is for cats. They have these for cats and dogs. Get the ones that are white and purple because the white and purple ones are for dogs and puppies. So, that's what those look like. And there's a hundred in here, but I've been using these for a while now. So you can see how thin they get. Normally, they're like this thick when you first get them. So, yeah. Next thing I have in here are some chews. Just some dental chews and some bully sticks. Next thing I have in here are more chews. I have some joint chews. Some pork hide and some chicken and sweet potato um, chews. And then I have her clothes in Ziploc bags. They're in the three Ziploc bags. Um, we won't go it, but if you want to see an updated dog clothes collection or all my dog's clothing, give this video a thumbs up. If I get 30 likes, I will do that. Just saying. Um, next thing I have is a collapsible bowl for water or and her for her food. Then I have some wa water buffalo jerky for dogs. Next thing I have is her cooling mat, which we always have to have on hand because she overheats so easily. And then I have her food in this container, which I got from Dollar Tree. This is just a airtight, and you can see you have to take and kind of push it up to get it open. I do not pour it out of here. I do keep a measuring cup and spanner. Um, as you can see, the blue thing in there is a measuring cup. Here, I'll take it off. Blue. So, that's the measuring cup I use for her food, and it's a fourth of cup measuring cup. Um, so, yeah. That's what I use to scoop her food with. And last thing I have in here is her baby blanket that I got from her for Ross. So, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.